So this is a teardown video of the Ego 56 volt 16 inch chainsaw and uh, basically this one had a problem with the controller so it will run for a second or two and then shuts off. I tore it apart and tried to fix it uh, but uh, they sent us a new one so I figured it was worth it to try to make it work. So it's kind of interesting, you can see the reduction here, uh, a lot of sawdust collected on the inside. That's the kickback switch. Um, here's the motor, and it actually routes the oil directly into the motor casing, which was a bit of a surprise. And there's the controller, uh, which is actually completely potted, which I thought was pretty cool, but it's definitely not easily replaceable. There's a uh, set of resistors, a large capacitor, uh, which seems fine. And then there's the main switch, which is pretty heavy duty. Um, so when I hooked up my e-bike batteries to the Ego power tools, I had a similar problem where it would run for about three seconds and then shut off. I think it has something to do with, you see you've got the positive, negative, and then the data connection there, the white wire, uh, which goes into the controller. So I think the controller has some issues. Uh, but I don't really care because we got a new Ego Chainsaw. They sent a, these guys really stand behind their tools and uh, I was pretty impressed with the build quality in here. None of the usual cheap Chinese crap. So my only complaint is um, the amount of sawdust that ends up in the motor compartment here. This chainsaw has seen about a year and a half of uh, pretty heavy duty use. So. And also you can see on the other side of the motor, it's got a cooling fan, and it looks, uh, everything just looks pretty high quality. Um, so, yeah, they impressed me.